Hi folks, it's Rob McMillan here with Prestige Homes. Uh, one thing we want to talk to you today about is uh, thermal bridging. So before we get too far into the details, maybe what we'll do is just have a quick look at a typical wall section. So what we have here is, is a typical 2x6 wall framing. Um, we have your, your insulation in, in the wall cavity, drywall on the opposite side, your vapor barrier, that sort of thing. So this, this would be pretty standard construction in most of the industry. You have your OSB sheathing over top, and, and that's kind of where it would end right there. Um, now some folks, they would increase your insulation value in that same stud cavity. And again, that doesn't really help you minimize the effects of thermal bridging. So, so what, is, what does that mean exactly? Well, if you look at the way the stud comes all the way through the cavity, it creates a bridge. So this is a pathway for, for thermal. So basically, heat can conduct its way through the framing all the way to the exterior, or in the summertime, it can go the opposite way. So when the heat's outside, it can actually transfer back into your home. So the effects can happen depending on the season of what, what, uh, what season we're in. So how do we stop that? Well, there's a couple ways we can do it. You can increase your insulation, which definitely does help. Um, but still, it doesn't really change the fact that thermal bridging is happening. So what we can do, though, is we can apply a layer of rigid insulation, which is what we like to do as one of our standards. Basically apply this rigid insulation over top of the sheathing. It goes right over top and acts as a blanket over top of your home. Just like yourself, when you're cold and you're shivering, you like to put a sweater or a jacket on top. Well, this is exactly what this is doing. This is going to make your home warmer. It's going to reduce that effects of the thermal bridge create a nice warm barrier for your home. Okay, so not only does rigid insulation provide a great barrier against thermal bridging, but it also gives you the added benefit of a, a, another barrier against water infiltration. It helps provide a nice noise buffer as well. So just a couple extra bonuses of using the rigid insulation. So I hope you learned a little bit of something today about thermal bridging. And if uh, you're not sure, ask your, your, your authorized dealer and we can certainly help you through the process. Thanks.